What to do if your hair dryer accidentally gets wet? First things first, if your hair dryer gets wet, unplug it immediately. Seriously, don't even think about using it while it's wet. Safety always comes first, and keeping it plugged in is a big no-no. Once it's unplugged, the next step is, yep, you guessed it, don't use it. Even if it's just a little damp, avoid the temptation. Using a wet hair dryer could lead to serious electrical shocks, and no one wants that. Now take a dry cloth and gently wipe down the outside. But here's the key part. Let it air dry completely. Please leave it in a dry spot for at least 24 hours. Trust me, you want to be patient with this one. If you think water might have gotten inside, give it a gentle shake. If you hear any water sloshing around, keep drying it. You want all that moisture out before even thinking about plugging it in again. After it's dry, could you take a moment to inspect it? Look for any damage, especially on the cord or plug. If it looks worn out or damaged, it might be time to replace it. All right, here's the final step. Test it safely. When it's fully dry, plug it into an outlet that has a ground fault circuit interrupter, or GFCI. This gives you extra protection in case something goes wrong. If the dryer doesn't work, or if you notice any burning smell, it's time to stop using it and either get it repaired or replace it. And there you have it. If your hair dryer ever gets wet, now you know exactly what to do to keep yourself safe. If you found this video helpful, make sure to give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button for more tips on keeping things safe and sound around your home.